Coming up, electric scooters in North Dakota finally make their debut. We meet Wachter Middle School's new winner of the Boys 100 Meter Dash, plus a look at the weather ahead. All this on KX Plus. Hey everyone, my name is Natalie Gomez, let's get to it. The birds have landed in Bismarck, the bird electric scooters that is. Residents now have the opportunity to hop on and ride around the downtown area. The scooters work through an app where riders pay per minute and will operate on the street and in bike lanes similar to a bicycle. They'll be enabled via a geofence to operate in specific areas within the city. Scooters are available to rent between 4 a.m. to midnight. All users are required to be 18 years of age and older. Will you be riding one around town? Let me know in the comments below. All right, moving on. Might wanna grab a tissue for this one. Talk about love, kindness, and true sportsmanship all in one video. This is at the track meet held at Wachter Middle School on Thursday. And the boy you see running in second place, his name is Grady Christensen. Grady has Down syndrome, and in his first track meet, he came in dead last, but things changed yesterday as his buddies planned to run alongside with him. You'll notice that a boy from a different school who was in the lead and who does not know Grady noticed what was going on behind him. At that moment, the unidentified leader slowed way down, and it was then Grady pulled into the lead, finishing first in his heat. The crowd cheered and were told there wasn't a dry eye in the stands. So cute and way to go, Grady. Let's talk about the weather real quick. The big story is that we'll be getting some much needed moisture. In some areas, it will be in the form of rain and in others in the form of snow. The KX Storm team will be working around the clock to bring you their latest research on this rain snow potential. You can stay up to date on our website, kxnet.com. That's all I have for you for now. Happy Friday, I'll see you later, bye.